Well, unfortunately, some of the South South APC leaders are beginning to have their own carcass because really they are beginning to organize uh, how the neck would come back. And remember that the uh, National Executive Council was actually dissolved by the president and also extended the tenor of the National Working and Planning Committee uh, for another six months. And these people gathered and were working something out on their own. Uh, Chief Odige Oyegu, Oshomole, Amechi, Silva, and other South South APC leaders meet about the dissolution of the National Executive Council. And uh, more details will come to you shortly. But please, hey guys, if you have not subscribed, please ensure you hit the subscribe button. And turn on the notification bell and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also uh, give this video a thumbs up. Okay, guys, without wasting much of your time, it's a wonderful day right here. And don't forget, this is Saffron Media, what will give you trending, exciting, reliable, and authentic happenings. Yes, this is the best place to be to get updated on the latest happenings in the world of politics in Nigeria. And don't forget to help us share this video and hit the like button. That is the best way we get to know that you are a part of this family and you are also with us yes thank you so much i cannot thank you enough for your love and your support so far yes right here it says the following following the december 8th meeting of the national executive committee neck of the ruling all progressive congress apc which dissolved all party structures leaders of the party from the south south are set for the uh, for a crucial meeting to review its status in the scheme of things. NEC had, among other resolutions, approved the immediate dissolution of all party organs from the polling units, word, local government, states, zonal to national levels. Those affected at the national level were national officers, often referred to as the non-national working committee component of the NEC. However, the next meeting approved their immediate reconstitution and composition to serve in their respective offices in a caretaker committee capacity, even as the non-national working committee members of, N of NEC were excluded from serving in that capacity. While the National Executive Committee extended the tenure of the governor, my Malaboni led caretaker extraordinary convention planning committee, by another six months, it endorsed the expulsion of Nut Farm Hilad Eta from the party for violating the directive to discontinue all forms of litigations against the party. It was gathered at the meeting of the South South leaders, which is scheduled for Tuesday in Abuja, would be looking at some of the resolutions of the NEC. Specifically, the meeting will discuss the possibility of retaining the office of the national chairman of the party in the South-South until June 2022, when the office would be resumed to the North. Our correspondent gathered that the meeting being convened by the National Secretary of the Party, Senator John Akpanwe Dede, and a former Deputy Governor of Edo State, Chief Lucky Imaswe, is expected to have an, in attendance the leader of the party for the zone and deputy senate president ov omar Gege. other leaders expected to attend are two former national chairman of the party chief john odige oyegun comrade adams shamole and as well the minister of health dr osage ehani ray others are ministers of niger delta affairs chief godswill akbabio Minister of State Labor, Mr. Festus Keyamo, former Governor of Cross River State, Mr. Clement Ebre, Senator Victor Undoma Ebe, Minister of Transport, uh, Minister Rotimi, Minister of Trans of State Petroleum, sorry about that, Minister of State Petroleum Chief Timi Pre Silva, Transport Minister Rotimi Amechi, Senator Magnus Abe, Prince Malik Afegboa, Mr. Wabili, Yam and over 100 others. Meanwhile, there is a growing concern about some political tendencies in the party following the extension of the tenor of the CECPC, that is the Ketika and, Ex and Extraordinary Committee, by six months. Originally, its six months mandate was slated to end by December 25th, 2020, but with the extension, the committee's tenor will now end by 30th of June 2021. 
A party source told us that many of those who were just in for the national chairmanship of the party have now recalled ostensibly to re-strategize. There were many of them eyeing the seats. We had one from Borneo State, one from Edo and from Zamfara, and other from Cross Rivers. There were others who were careful not to make their ambitions known. No one can say exactly if the zoning formula for party offices would be thinked with by next year. So everyone is just strategizing and trying to reposition. The main focus is the membership registration and revalidation. We need to ensure that our members file out to participate in the exercise because numbers would also determine some things in the party, said a party source. On its part, a group with the party, the concerned APC members, frowned at the dissolution of the party structures and the tenor extension granted the CECPC, urging President Muhammad Buhari not to allow selfish individuals destroy the party. Spokesman of the group, Abdullahi Dauda, said the pronouncement by our party's neck did not come to us as a surprise. We knew about the plot long before today. We wish to say it is beginning of another long journey for our party. If those who have hijacked the party think they can frustrate us out of the party, so many people came together to build, they should think again because we are not leaving. We as loyal members of this great party will continue to ask our leaders, President Muhammad Buhari, not to allow a few selfish individuals misguide him into taking actions that will destroy this party. Well, obviously, guys, you've seen that uh, there are uh, a lot of internal issues in the All Progressive Congress because, of course, uh, most of the South South leaders are beginning to have a backdoor meeting, hoping and holding uh, this meeting just to uh, believe that the party is wrong for dissolving, uh, you know, the structures in the party. And everyone is eyeing the position of the chairmanship just after the former chairman, Adam Soshomole, was, you know, suspended as the national chairman. It has been uh, a huge shock to a lot of people, hoping that uh, there will be a convention this year and there will be leadership and uh, structures and all of that. But unfortunately, the president came and dissolved every structure in the party, leaving just the caretaker and extraordinary planning committee for uh, for another six months to take care of things in the party. But all the same, you've seen that a lot of people, over 100 South South leaders are gathering just to ensure that there's peace and tranquility or perhaps for their own selfish reasons. Well, you can tell us what you think about what their meeting is all about. And also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for staying tuned. Do have a pleasant time. Bye for now.